I think somebody rang up some more Sunbelt talk. Let's do Marshall at Georgia Southern. Marshall just beat the doors off of App State last week. They look good. They looked really good. Uh, what is Marshall's overall record right now? Three and two. They are five and zero oh against the spread. Uh, on the other side, Georgia Southern three and two, and they are four and one against the spread. So these are two teams that uh, the market has not quite caught up to yet, and that's okay. Marshall right now is a two and a half point road favorite. Total of sixty two and a half on this, and my numbers like Georgia Southern. I've got Georgia Southern favored by two point six three. Uh, based on the last four weeks of projections, I've got Georgia Southern by 1.36. So, where are the mismatches? Well, Georgia Southern is uh, a passing offense. They throw the ball over 56% of the time. That's number 29 in the country. Marshall is number 36 in PPA allowed per pass. Georgia Southern, while they throw it a lot, they're only number 77 in that metric. Uh, you start looking at passing success rate, etc., Georgia Southern ain't great, but they they have been able to put up enough points to be able to cover, etc. They they play a very uncomfortable style of football, which is why they are four and one against the spread so far. Uh, they don't turn the ball over. Neither of these teams do. Uh, neither really gets a bunch of takeaways. Neither team super explosive. Um, Georgia Southern is not great at defending explosive plays, so that's certainly something to pay attention to. Uh, you look at scoring opportunities per game, points per scoring opportunity. Uh, Georgia Southern, when they get inside the opponent 40-yard line, they're going to put up points. They are number 15 in points per scoring opportunity. Now, they only do it 5.8 uh, drives per game, and Marshall can't stop it. So that's that's not a good thing. On the other side... Uh, Marshall, not great at finishing drives. They're number 103 in points per scoring opportunity. And good old Georgia Southern can't stop it. So somebody's going to have to stop somebody somewhere. I think with this being a home game, Marshall, big win over App State last week. Georgia Southern, I think, feels good at home. The numbers certainly agree with it. Give me Georgia Southern plus two and a half. I think they will win the game outright uh, down in Statesboro. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and follow me on Twitter, at GaryWCE. If you want to toss in a question, you can email me, Gary, at winningcureseverything.com. Make sure and hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you next time.